This is James Holder for iPhone London. I'm in Frederick's restaurant today for the press conference between Billy Joe Saunders and John Ryder. With me, I've got John Ryder. How are you doing, John? I'm good, James. How are you, mate? I'm all right, mate. I'm all right. Can you tell me a little bit how your fight preparation's going? It's gone really well. I mean, I'm, I've had a, a good long camp. I mean, it's a continuation on from the last fight, pretty much. I've not had the chance to get unfit. I'm feeling good. My sparring's been good, and I'm just raring to go. A lot of people say, look, when Southpaws fight, it's a bit of an awkward affair. Um, what are your thoughts on that? Yeah, people say two Southpaws make a dull fight, but I just can't see it myself. I think he's a, he's a comfortable fighter, so am I. We've both got good boxing brains. I just think it's going to be a good fight. A lot's been made about how fast Billy Joe's hands are, his hand speed. Um, what have you got planned to deal with that, John? Head movement. If, he, um, if, he's not, if he's throwing fast fans and he's not hitting nothing, then he's going to tire himself out, isn't he? But, I mean, that's a small part of it. It's, uh, it's all right making him miss, but I've got to make him pay as well. So it's going to be a hard fight. I, I fully suspect it will go 12 rounds, but I'm looking forward to it. I think I can beat him. Um, I've read that you've done a bit of sparring with James DeGau a little bit up to the build-up to this fight. Um, how much of a help has he been for you? Yeah, James is good because he's... Like, I'm fighting for a British title, but I believe James is he's on, he's on the cusp of a world title fight. So it's good. He's, he's that level above and it's good preparation. It's ideal. Billy, Billy Joe said today that he believes he's near on world level. Do you think that's a fair statement? Yeah, I don't see why not. He's obviously number six with the WBO, so yeah, he's nearing it. I mean, less deserving people have got world title shots. So um, yeah, he, um, he, why not? He's, he's still he's made his thoughts clear that he wants to keep the British and win it outright. So he's got a couple more fights there. But um, yeah, I'll, why not? Silly question, but how much would it mean to you to get your name etched on that Lonsdale belt? Oh, I want it. I don't want it just a, a participant. I want it as the champion. I want to be the winner. I want it outright. I want to keep that belt. They're nice belts. I mean, some belts are given out too easily, but not them British titles. You've got to win them outright. Do you know what I mean? And that's First thing. Yeah, definitely. Um, Islington, can we expect a lot of people coming down to the Copper Box to support yourself uh, come, come fight night? Yeah, definitely. I think I've sold about 470. I think Georgia Keane sold about, I think they said 700. So. 700? Yeah, I know. Yeah, fucking... Should have turned pro a while ago, but um, yeah, no, I mean, that's, that's like, if that goes, that's over a thousand people from Islington, so hopefully if half and cheer my name, it'll be a good crowd. Uh, I know Eddie Earns in Liverpool today, you've got Tony Sims come down with you today. On the fight, do you know who's going to be there? Will it be Eddie or maybe uh, the Don Baza, as we call him? I think old Baza's going to be there, so um, he'll probably come down and cause a riot, but um, yeah, it's going to be fun. It's, uh, Baza's a man as well, isn't he? Eddie can't be there, so Baza will be there, but I'm looking forward to it. Very honest man, Baza. Oh yeah, he'll tell you, if you're shit, he'll tell you shit. If you're good, he'll tell you it's good. Just don't disrespect Purdy around him, and you'll be all right. No, exactly. Yeah, I mean, he, but I think Purdy's his little favourite. But hopefully, I'll change that Saturday night, and I'll be up there. I can't wait for the fight. It's, everyone's anticipating it. It's such a great fight, and the card in general is a good card. Listen, I wish you the best of luck with what you're doing. I hope you and Billy Joe both come out safe, whatever the outcome, and I'll be watching it with great intent. Cheers, James. Thank you. This is James Helder with John the Gorilla Rider for iFilm London.